Alright, hey guys, GG, and welcome back to more Black Ops 2. So, today I'm giving you guys this class setup. Now, before we get into this, I just want to uh, apologize real quick for the lack of videos these past couple of days. If you haven't heard yet, I was just a bit sick and all, and uh, I'm a little bit better to do this commentary now, but, um, so basically you guys have just been like, oh, GG, how do you get, like, all these swarm gameplays and such? Because, you know, ever since I got my first swarm, all my commentaries thus far in Black Ops 2 has just just been swarm gay plays this and that every single where and like you guys were just wondering like even this gameplay right here is a swarm gay play can you can you guys like believe that um so i just want to do this class setup here finally because you guys have been asking for it and um this one's actually pretty interesting in particular because this is actually pretty good for beginners now the reason why i say that it's because not only are you going to be like rushing and getting all those kills, but you're also going to be playing the objective. Now in Black Ops 2, what they wanted to do with this game is really reward the players for actually helping out their team. And they wanted to make it like based on your performance and whatnot. So you're definitely heavily going to be investing in uh, playing the objective and everything. So you guys can see here, every single kill I got, I would try to collect as much tags as I can. And it really helps me to uh, get my uh, score streaks a lot faster. So that's what you guys are going to be doing. So, um... Right here is my class setup. You guys can go ahead and pause the video or whatever you need to do to uh, quickly create the class. But um, so the reason why I chose the MP7 as the primary is because, in my opinion, it is the best SMG in the game. Now, the reason why I say this is for a couple reasons, okay? So, first of all, it's a really well-rounded gun, and um, it just has the highest the highest damage for a uh, gun type and along with the damage it has really good accuracy like I was getting mid-range kills and up close I don't even need to aim I can just hit fire and it's just really accurate and easy to kill them and along with the damage and the uh, ac accuracy it has a pretty decent amount of bullets it can contain so like the PDW has 50 bullets and this MP7 has 40 bullets which is uh, enough to actually like kill someone and if someone comes up like next to you you can kill them too and then quickly reload and that leads us to the attachments that I use so um basically first of all I use the fast mags and um if you guys pay close attention I actually reload every single time right after I get a kill and uh, it takes just like less than a second to reload so it's really useful you guys want to be racking up those points and um it's just really useful so the second attachment you guys will probably be like hmm like like what are you using that for so I'm using adjustable stock and basically what it does when you aim down the sight, it helps you to strafe a lot quicker. So like you can move to the left, move to the right a lot quicker. And um, it just helps with the forsado aspect of this class setup. So moving on to the perks. Uh, first of all, I use Hardline. Now that's pretty self-explanatory. You know, you guys are going to be using that for your score streaks and whatnot to help build them up. And um, the next perk I use is Lightweight. So this perk basically defines this whole class. So you're going to be rushing and lightweight really helps you get across the map you want to play the objectives too so it helps you get like to the flags collect the tags quickly and whatnot and get into the enemy lines and for the perk two i use scavenger now scavenger like you definitely need it you want to stick to the mp7 it's a really well-rounded gun and um with combined with lightweight it's pretty easy to pick up the scavenger packs too so um for the perk threes i basically use dexterity and what, de what de dexterity does it um helps you like aim down the sights faster which also means it helps you uh, shoot faster too and um the next one i use is tag mass now Stun grenades, stun grenades, and stun grenades. Those things are probably the most annoying thing in the game. Like, um, if you're playing Ground War, I think Ground War is actually a really good game mode to play with this class setup. I, like, got a swarm on it, but unfortunately, Thin Mode didn't record it. But, um, yeah, when you're running around the map, you don't want to get stopped by those stun grenades or, like, explosives. It helps you increase your chances of surviving and being able to carry on and kill the other team. But, um, that's basically the class setup there. And, uh, I'll tell you guys what. Once this video reaches 40 likes, I will put out another class setup video. And I actually have a really good one for that, too. And you guys don't want to miss it out. So, uh, be sure to support the video with a like. And I will see you guys later. I hope you guys enjoy this. And peace.